When you encounter <coughs> these young Filipinos mm. on the level of college, and say, say, let's say they had that gap yeah. uh, from, from high school, what's the most striking thing uh, that, that, that hit you? I mean, what, what, I don't, give us an, we've been painting a picture of the education mm -hmm. system. Paint me a picture of a young Filipino entering college right now, and mm. what's the most striking thing about their knowledge or their lack of knowledge uh, as, as you've encountered? Hmm. Okay. So, in college, what usually yung nakakashock is yung hindi, one, syempre hindi alam yung basics. Then, uh, another thing, especially sa so, Gen Z I mean, how yun, basic? Uh, I mean, how, how, how basic, basic ang hindi nila alam? Yung, ano, uh, yung... Do they know that we were colonized? Do they know that the, you they, know... They know those hmm. things, pero, kumbaga, hindi nagstick or okay. hindi, uh, kumbaga, walang lalim yung kanilang uh, pagkakaintindi. Ako feeling ko generally, in, well, baka failure ko rin sa teacher. Uh -oh. Sometimes I get disappointed when at the end of the SEM, parang dun sa output nila, no, in the reflection paper, wala akong nakikita ng sense of ownership doon sa our narrative. <laughs> Whatever that narrative, narrative is. is. Parang di ba yung, this is our, this is our history, mm. our story. Mm. So, somehow, sa, sa, sa exam ko, may mga questions ako doon na titingnan ko sa response nila kung meron bang shared, naramdaman nilang bahagi sila ng kwentong ito. Ano ba yung tanong mo? Uh, well, ang tanong ko ay, uh, uh, Una kasi, uh, maikli ano yung uh, kahapon ng Pilipinas? Ano ito ngayon? At sa tingin mo, ano ito bukas? Yung time frame lang ng noon uh -huh. at ngayon. So, summary, kasi ayoko naman yung magbukang trivia na nasa details uh -huh. eh. But it's a sense of nation. Uh -huh. um, so, kung baga, can you tell the story of, of our course, nation? Of uh course, -huh. that's, that's objective uh -huh. eh. Parang kakaya nila ikwento sa isa kapatid nilang grade 1, grade 2. Uh -huh. Na ito yung kwento ng Pilipinas, malaya tayo noon, uh -huh. sinakop tayo, pinaglaban natin ang kalayaan natin, uh -huh. uh, inadhika nating uh -huh. maging maunlad, magkaroon ng maayos na, pa na pamahalaan, uh -huh. maayos na lipunan. Uh -huh. Ganon. Yeah. Kahit na ganun lang kabasic. Hindi ko, minsan sa iba, hindi sila umaabot sa ganong realization ng pang, pang malakihang pagtingin sa bansa. So what is the narrative in their mind? When they try, when they, when okay. they try, what, what is the, what's the most basic narrative that our young Filipinos can, can express? Okay. I have a similar question doon sa final exam ko. Ang tanong ko naman, <coughs> who is the Filipino? Sino ang Filipino? Mm. So sasagutin nila in a basic narrative. Ang nakaka... Pinamanak sa Pilipinas. Yun, ay, ganyan, ang basic... No? lang is na stuck sila or they cannot grow beyond uh, pinanganak sa Pilipinas perlas ng silangan ah. at saka lahing kayo manggi mm. hanggang doon lang eh, eh kumbaga yung pagka Pilipino goes beyond our skin color mm. kasi may mga mestiza mm. Chinese na rin na naging Filipino etc so hindi ko rin makita yung grand narrative na ang Filipino was born out of the struggle natin na gusto natin guminhawa yung ating bayan at nagpapatuloy siya sa ating quest for full freedom and democracy.